Hello, my little friends. How you doing today? We are back with some Fire Emblem Path of Radiance, and we are already on this level. Oh, let's get the mouse out of there. Oh, my goodness. We are already back to Galia. We can do all these random things if we want with these peeps. Well, what do we want to do? Do we have to do anything here? Well, Boyd could really use an axe, so let's give him an axe. Yeah, whatever kind of axe we want to get. Probably the most expensive one we can afford. A steel axe. Give it to Boyd really quick. Sure, why not? And then, I don't know, what else could we possibly do? She's pretty cool. She's pretty sweet. He's pretty sweet. Everybody's pretty darn good. She can give her an axe, too, if we want, but I don't really care about her. She sucks. She is a terrible person. Any support? Well, I think if you do these things, you can, like, eventually get them up to something, but I don't even care about them, really, to be completely honest with you. I think you get some sort of bonuses when you keep them in the game together, if you keep doing that, so maybe it'll be worth it, but I don't really care enough to do that. You can give people experience and stuff like that. I have a bunch of experience I can give away. 1,430 experience, but we're going to wait on that because I'm actually going to use it on two certain people, which you guys might be able to see pretty darn soon. Let's leave the base and get ready to go. All right, this place brings back such memories. It hasn't changed the slightest. Oh, she's been to Galia before. What? She was a knight of Crimea. Whoa, man, that was pretty good. I didn't know she was that. All right, that's right. I've missed the sea when the setting sun strikes the water. Oh, no. Too bad, so sad. Now she's all sad. She's like, oh, I used to be here. I don't know how old she is. If I had to guess, I'd guess she's like 25, 30, I guess. We'll finish our talk later after we've reached the castle. Well, that was cryptic. I guess they're just kind of confused about it. What is it, Mordecai? Do you tire? Should we rest here? No, I think we're all right. Good. Yay. Birk is such a weak species. Oh, man, she's such a meanie pant. Distance like this is nothing. Leth, no, it's the truth. And now they're arguing about each other. You know, you can tell Leth really hates them, hates us, and Mordecai is kind of like, you know, trying to be nice about it, at least a little bit. What is it? Uh-oh, that smell in the wind. It's iron, the smell of beer, heavily armored, well armed. Uh-oh, SpaghettiOs. We got more of these bad boys coming in here. All of a sudden, they just pop out of nowhere. There's a bunch of them, too. General Kotaf. Kotaf, that's a funny name. Silly little Kotaf. They're trapped. Call every last man ready for battle. We stop the enemy here. All right, there's really not that many of them. I've had to count 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 16, 17 of them. Maybe that's it, probably. All right, well, let's get going. Okay, so we get eight of our units. Reposition them. I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to send Oscar up there. I'm going to send... Uh, to be honest, everybody else can just freaking handle them handle them yeah he can handle himself up there we'll let oscar do that take all that uh, experience and stuff and actually you know what i'll send boyd up there boyd needs the experience so let's make sure boyd's getting the experience over here and uh we'll send boyd and oscar and boyd's just going to kind of tank most of the damage i think and i think we're all set to go so now we got two new characters we got rolf and we got mist which again this is ike's sister this is uh, Boyd and Oscar's brother, and they're both level one. So now you're understanding what the, the importance of experience right here. Level one, level one, 18 health and 16 health. That's kind of ridiculous. She's a healer. He's an, a bow. So we finally got uh, an archer here. Uh, let's make these people work. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna send everybody down here as far as possible. So we're gonna get Soren over here. Alanya over here, and all those good people. Staff, we can ward these people as well. Getting some experience in here. That's the, that's the point of ward. Uh, who else can we send? We can send her down here. She can reach. I'm also going to send Ike down there as well. And Alanya. Whoa, we're sending lots of people. And then these three can go up towards the front here. Kind of just keep... Uh, the point is just to keep her protected. Keep Misty protected. I keep wanting to say Misty. It's Mist. Alright. And then uh, Titania, we can move her up here as well. And just wait it out. So what do these peeps want to do? There's those little those little guys. Now, what, now the problem is is that uh, the way that they work... Oh, man, look at this. Watch this amazingness. Ba-boom! 28 critical hit right there. These people are strong, as you can tell. The only real issue that I have is that they... Uh, sometimes they're kind of noob cake alicious because they can't attack all the time. They can only attack when they're in beast mode, which you have to wait a certain amount of time for them to be in beast mode or whatnot. By the way, what is it? If there's some special task you would ask of us, we are willing to listen. Okay. All right, sweet. Skip that stuff. 
So let's get some attacks in here. We want Rolf to get in here and start attacking peoples. Rolf can Rolf bow this guy. Ba-boom. Oh, only four damage. I thought I was going to do way more than that. Eh, not terrible. What you going to do? Soren can run in here, wind him really quick. And again, we're just going to kill this guy really easily because he's got a poleaxe. Got a freaking poleaxe. Oh, she gets a double attack! Or like a triple, quadruple attack. I think uh, every once in a while she gets one of those attacks where she gets to attack twice as much as what she would normally attack. He. 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 And they get nothing. Come on, Soren. You're really sucking it up for me. So what we're going to do is we're going to direct them to... Uh, Target over here. I don't like them. I don't want them to get it, steal all my experience and stuff, so let's just uh, do that. We'll move her up here. Um, actually, we can move her all the way up here, actually. She can take a little bit of a... She can take a little bit of a beating. And that's pretty much it. We'll just ward somebody. I guess we can uh, uh, ward Rolf, I suppose. Just help him out just that tiny itty-bitty bit. Little itty-bitty bit. Oh, we're almost level. We're almost level eight. Who else is left? Oh, we got this entire team over here. Yes. Um. Uh, well, what are we gonna do? There we go. At least we get a double attack on this guy, and we are gonna kill him too if we hit. Of course, if we hit. Yes, he does. Goodness gracious! If he missed, I would have been very upset. And then uh, Oscar's obviously gonna destroy this guy. One hit kill. You can't beat that. Move him up as far as possible, and uh, nobody else is going to even get close to Mist. I think Mist is such a weird name. At least I think so. Mist? I was going to say Mist. I guess maybe I'm just used to Pokemon. I don't know. Maybe that's why. So they're going for Ike already, as you can tell. This little soldier is trying to kill him, but Ike's like, Oh yeah, suck my balls, man. You can't take me down. You can't even touch this. And then he's like, Oh, suck real good. But nope, nope, not going to happen, because... Uh, no, that that's a little too gay for, gay for Ike. No, Ike's pretty boss. And uh, we're getting to the point where Oscar's really not getting as much experience as we'd really like him to get. So what I'm going to do is I actually do not want this pirate to get anywhere near those houses up there. So we're going to have him uh, uh, kill this guy, hopefully. Maybe not this turn, but at least the next turn. Oh, we did! He hurt him a ton! Holy crap, all up perfection right there. He got a critical hit on him. It's only 21 damage, which isn't that amazing. But what you're gonna do, this Myrmidon can actually go over here and attack attack him and kill him really quick. Nice. And we killed him, so we got rid of at least one pirate. I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly, that a bunch of stupid pirates come a little bit later as well. Um, and our, our... Well, what are we gonna do? How about uh, get Soren to run over here and just attack really quick. Wind him up. Boom. And how, many, how much damage? None. No damage. And he hit me, too. Ooh, weapon level up. And I'll, Alanya will get her over here. She she could attack really quick. She'll just elf under him. And then we're probably going to kill him with Rolf. Uh, I think Rolf can take him down. Come on, Rolf. Let's do this, Shiznit. Let's do this. Kind of hide Rolf in the back here, but I'm pretty sure he can kill him. Yep, look at that. I mean, I could do more intense, like, adding up of things, minus their defense and type of thing, but I really don't care that much. So we're actually going to hide Rice right here and uh, ward somebody. Let's ward, uh, I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? I am i don't even see any more, any mages ro roaming around. There's no more mages roaming around anywhere. Come on, come on, little priesty. Oh, he's got still got zero defense. That's pretty lame. Who's Boyd going to kill? Let's have him kill this guy. Actually, first things first. Boom, Shaka, and frickin' Laka. Staff him up. And we're actually going to do something kind of weird right here. So, uh, yeah. We're going to do it this way. Well, actually, maybe we could... Oh, we can. We can double steal axe him. Maybe we'll actually kill him. Oh, no. No. His, de his defense is just too good. But not Not terrible. Not terrible what happened right there. Oscar's just going to have to kind of get in the way right now. And we're going to block this guy so they can't get to Mist. Oh, this guy is still alive? It's another attack on Oscar. Oh, man. And we're getting to the point where Titania might be kind of almost as weak as uh, as Oscar. I think Oscar might be better than Titania, to be completely honest with you guys. Let's check him out. 13, 15, 14, 13, 15. Yep, she's weaker than him. His defense is way better. 
Oh my goodness. So guess what we can do is just kind of leave him right here. Just wait. I don't even care. If she wants to run away or wants to attack me, either way is fine by me. And I'm surprised that guy actually wanted to attack Ike. You know, I kind of expect him to uh, want to attack one of those uh, mages, but I guess not. So what do I even have to do? Do I have to route the enemy or do I have to seize? So if I have to seize, I should start maybe moving Ike more towards the front there. Or uh, uh, so we can actually seize it by the time we actually need to do that. And boy, yeah, come on, get that experience. Roll it in! Roll in an experience right now. Boy, I love you, man. I love you. And he's getting a bunch of stuff. No defense, but that's okay. And look at this. Who is that? It's Marcia. Marcia the Pegasus. You guys have seen her in the early game. Uh, around, I think it was like level 3 or so. Who are they? Oh, hell, I found them. So now what are we going to do? So, um, yeah. Do something like this. Oh, we get a double attack with that. I guess we'll just, we'll just thunder him. If we kill him, we kill him. If not, we don't. Oh, yeah, we're not going to kill him. Perfect. That's actually what I want to happen, because I want Rolf to kill him to get more experience, because the lower the people, the more experience they're going to get, and it's just going to work out perfect for us. Rolf's ball, double attack. Boom. Shaka. Laka. Rolling experience. Look at this. Oh, my God. Oh, we only got, like, 40. I thought I was going to get more than that. That's okay. We'll wind this guy really quick. And we're actually going to have to have both of our swordsmen attack. Eh. Eh. We might not even kill this guy. Oh, man, I hope he doesn't roll over there and attack Rolf. That would be bad. Whoa, this guy's actually really freaking fast. This guy's good. He's not very strong, but he's good. So I guess what we can do is... Oh, man, how fast is Rolf? How fast is he? His speed is only 6. This guy's speed is 13. Oh, poopsicles. This is not good, guys. I don't know what I'm going to do. I guess I just have to hope for the best right now. Hope that this guy does not kill Rolf. He could, maybe. Uh, we'll just leave him here. Staff. We'll heal Ike, I suppose. I don't know. Rolf's going to be in trouble right here. That's all I have to say. All I have to say. And we'll just run Boyd and Oscar up in there. Just run them up. Who the heck cares? As far as possible. And who's left? Titania. I guess we can run her over here, too. Just in case. She can't really do anything in the sand, but maybe... Let's see, what's going Oh, he is attacking Rolf. Come on, Rolf, dodge it! Oh, yep! Oh, my goodness gracious, he survived. Oh, that was tight. That was really tight. Oh, man, if he, if he would have died, I would have been so sad. A level 1 Rolf, come on. I honestly didn't think that guy was going to be so good. I thought I could be able to take him down, or at least when three guys attacked him, I thought they would be able to take him down, but nope. So Marcia is going to come and talk to Ike, of course. Uh-oh, and here they are. Here's the goofy little pirates. <laughs> Yar har ho. Oh, yo ho har. Oh, you scallywags of the sea we are. Oh, and they're rhyming too. We fight like beasts and man do flee. We earn our gold with axes bold. You scurvy bills rat, why aren't you singing? Ha ha ha. Nyuck, nyuck, Stupid little pirates. I don't even know what they're talking about, to be honest. I don't even care. They're just kind of rhyming to each other and talking about how they're pirates. And they can float on water, obviously. So that's pretty sweet. So Marcia is going to be able to get to Ike from here. So let's make sure that happens. Rolf's going to get healed first thing. It's the first thing, because I don't want him to die. And then we're going to for sure need to take this guy down. So, I mean, he's got a lot of health right now. 12 health still. Probably kill him with the Lanya, maybe. Get an El Thunder going. And he's level 2! So watch this deliciousness right here. Rolf, you are amazing, my friend. We're not going to kill him, but at least we'll damage him. What? This guy's way too freaking good. I'm not liking it. Well, one of them's going to have to kill him after all these attacks. Oh my goodness. I'd really like Ike to actually kill him. Come on, Ike, don't miss this time. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Well, now what do I do? Well, 
now I gotta have him attack. <sighs> so sad, too bad. But now we should actually have Marcia come here and be on our team, so this guy cannot really move through the sand very well. As you can tell, it's really limiting our range. That's the difference of, of terrain! So I guess we'll just move her back over here, maybe help out a tiny bit a little bit later. And that's pretty much it. Is that all we have left? Oh, a few of these guys. A few of them. I might actually have Oscar attack first. Because I need, I need them to, uh, well, I guess it doesn't matter, does it? I just want to make sure they cannot get to Little Mist over there. Absolutely. No, you cannot attack her. Again, I'm trying. I'm really trying to protect these guys who are low levels, and it's kind of tough now. We're getting to that point where it's just, it's getting rough for me. We'll actually hand axe things. Who are we going to attack with the hand axe? Well, I guess I will just keep the iron axe out for now. And they're going to keep trying to attack him, for sure. See, look, there they are. Now they're both little, little, uh, leth, or I mean, lagoos. They're both lagoos right now. Oh, now they're trying to attack Mia again. And is that in a thunder? It looks like a thunder, not an L thunder. There's some really cool magic you can end up using in the late, in the, uh, late game here. It's actually, there's some things that you can attack people from, like, ten things away. It's kind of ridiculous. And look at that, they're all trying to attack Boyd, and he's got almost no health left. Come on. Yeah, Marcia! Ike! You're... You're that? That's right. It's me, Marcia. As promised, I'm here to pay my debt. I'm going to join your group. Join us? But I thought you were one of the Holy Pegasus Knights. Pfft, I resigned. Uh, what are you going to say? You let me in or what? Are you sure about this? I mean, I'll be honest with you. We're a destitute band of mercenaries. Your wages will be pittance compared to what you're used to. So what? Are you saying no? No, I'm simply pointing out that you'll be losing almost all... Well, all right. Come on, please let me join. Oh, she's so cute. Well, if that's what you want, I guess I'll give you a shot. Oh, that's great. Just tell me what you need doing. So now that we got Marcia, well, she still kind of sucks. She's kind of a low level, but she gets really freaking good, and that's that's what's so amazing. Now, these guys are really strong. We need to get we need to get over here really freaking fast. So let's run on over here. We're gonna get uh, run her over here. Rolf and stuff. We'll just have these guys all attack the mages. I might actually have Marcia go and attack those pirates a little bit, because she can just fly over the water and stuff. And I still forgot what... Oh, she's going to get a double attack. Might kill him. No, won't kill him. That's okay. We'll just have Rolf kill them. Get more experience! <laughs> experience is just what we like to see. As long as Rolf doesn't die right here. Oh my god, I could just imagine that happening. So I do have to seize, so that means Ike's actually going to have to start coming over, over here. Um, and we'll also have... Man, this is going to be a little rough for me. What are we going to do here? Um, guess we can kill this guy first thing. There we go, critical hit. I mean, it didn't really matter, but I guess it's kind of nice. And I'm actually going to use Mist over here to uh, heal him. And I might actually uh, rescue her. I have not yet decided. Because Boyd still has not very much health, to be honest. I think what we can do is... Yeah, well, he's gonna... I'm just going to heal him up. I don't want him to die. You know, you got three swordsmen over there. What if one of them gets a double attack on him? That's just going to suck for us. So I am going to uh, save her really quick. I do not want that archer to, to come and kill her. That would just be plain terrible. Uh, we're going to lose a turn on that, but uh, honestly, it's not that big of an issue. She's going to have to kill these pirates, though. It's going to be Marcia and Mia. The women. The women have to unite. Let's go, women's Marcia. Actually, we can have Marcia probably get over to that... Uh, that little area over there. Enemy phase. How far? Oh, yeah, look at that. And, of course, look at this. These guys are attacking Boyd like crazy, man. There's going to get at least two guys, maybe even three of them attacking him, because they're going to get the archer, too. Oh, there's a... That's a good thing. We got the actual lance guy coming, not the sword guy, because the uh, sword guy is definitely a bigger issue, if you ask me. 
Oh, and he got his hand axe out too, so that gave him a little bit of extra, a little bit of an extra advantage. And the thing about the enemies is they're very predictable. You know that they're, if they have the ability to attack, they're pretty much going to attack if they have full health, no matter what. Even if it's a terrible, terrible guy versus like a really, really uh, one of your best guys ever. So I think what we can do is just, uh, yeah, we'll just steal axe this guy really quick. I think we'll kill him in one hit. Boom. Still do have a lot of guys that we have to kill, though. A lot of guys we ought to kill. And Oscar's pretty much full health right now. Who else do we have to do? We'll just drop her off really quick. Drop. And now we have to go over here. So what are we going to do with this stuff? Well, first things first. Let's get uh, grab the things out of here. Eek, you humans! Oh, no! Um, Urk, uh, oh, come on. You're so rude. If you can't tell, I'm playing dead, so go away. <laughs> it's funny that they're they're scared of us. Because my mother told me if you ever meet a bee, Urk, play dead, and it'll leave you a bee. It's not true, is it? I knew it wasn't true. I knew it. Well, then take this and get out of here quickly. I hate humans. I don't want to talk to you. Shoo. So they really hate us. Oh, we got a restore staff. Ooh. Now we get some pretty strong guys over here. Like, how strong are they? Well, he's not that fast. I mean, he won't get a double attack on me, I don't think. But if I have two of these guys attack me, I'm pretty much dead. So let's see if we can get a... Let's see if we can start damaging this guy. I don't even know if he's going to try to attack me. He might. But I think what we're going to do is we're probably going to be able to kill that this guy with a couple of these mages. And then just kind of clean up the rest. Uh, after that. So we're going to actually hide rice behind them. And same with uh, uh, Rolf. We're going to just put them right behind where they can reach. That's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. Come on, come on. Oh, they're attacking Marcia. Oh, you, you're a beast, Marcia. Dodging it like a beast. Attacking the pirates. Going to go visit and stuff. Oh, they are attacking Alanya. Oh, and look at that. We dodged him nice and easy. But uh, one problem is you could... Oh, he, got... he had a... Whoa. That is freaking scary. If she didn't dodge it, she would have died. Holy crap. We're getting... We got lucky there. I'm not going to lie. Got freaking lucky. So we're going to have to take him out, like, right now. We got to. There's nothing else we could possibly do. And Oscar's just keep going up level after level after level. He's already level 17. He's almost up to going up a class, which is just plain amazing. Yeah, that's kind of scary over there. Goodness gracious. Um, Miss is just going to keep healing peoples. Okay, so what are we going to do? Okay, so I gotta kill this guy. First things first, let's get uh, Soren to attack. We'll wind him. Nice and easy. Or fire him. Let's wind him. And we did at least 8 damage. I mean, that helps. It helps, but it's not really the best thing ever. Rolf. Uh... There we go. There we go. Yes, and and she's... Oh, my goodness. That Thank you so much, Elanya. Thank you for being awesome. And we got a ton of experience for that. Gotta make sure we heal her up, because she's poisoned right now, which kind of sucks. And uh, we'll kind of leave Rolf right there, because nobody can hit him. We'll just have her visit really quick and kind of run away. We just don't even want to deal with these stupid pirates. All right, what do these guys want? Oh, yeah, just give me your thing. I don't care. A talisman! Yeah! I guess maybe we can kill this guy if we want to. We'll just see. I don't know, maybe the, the extra, extra experience could be nice. Maybe we'll one-hit kill him. Oh, well, that's not good. <laughs> that's a lot of damage. Tan damage. And Oscar, I suppose you could just start killing this guy. Oh, he's got a Night Killer, so let's not do that. Let's not do that. Yeah, let's just run away. We'll actually have uh, we'll have Ike do it probably, or 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 Boyd. 
other way, really. So they're still trying to attack Marcia over here, but she's just dodging it. Look at that. Oh, well, that's not good. That makes me sad. She's still getting hurt. So what are we going to do? Guess we can heal Boyd and see if, see what Boyd can do. And if we need to, we'll rescue him really quick. Titania and Oscar can both rescue Boyd. I don't think that's going to be that big of a problem for us. So let's steel axe him. Maybe we'll even dodge one of his attacks. Oh, well, I guess it didn't work out the way I thought it was going to. So, well, not the end of the world, I suppose. We'll just wait him over here. And what are we going to do now? Poop! Mega poop! Now she's poisoned too. What the heck? How far can this guy reach? Probably pretty darn far. Yeah, actually pretty darn far. Uh, let's just get everybody out of here. Let's get everybody pretty darn far away. Soarin' too. Move him. Move him, move him, move him. We'll uh, kind of just heal Marcia really quick just so she doesn't die. Marie, M Mia can ta kind of take care of herself, but... Don't want to die, obviously. <laughs> um, you know, I'll leave him in uh, in her range. She can get one attack on her. And uh, that's the end. Well, how do we... There we go. End. Yahoo! Is that Mario enough for you? So there we go. These guys are still trying to attack me. They really want to steal something from me. I don't really completely understand, so that's okay, I guess. And we're going to actually... She's actually going to kill him really nice and easy. Still getting poisoned, though. Poop. Boyd, yeah. Yeah, Boyd. Well, that sucks. Now Boyd's gone. Well, I guess we're going to have to deal with it, because Boyd, well, screw you, Boyd. You're out of here. This is, this is the game. This is the game, guys. Sometimes crap happens. So crap has just happened to us, and we're going to have to deal with it. So let's, uh, I don't know how we got two attacks on him that time, but didn't get two attacks on him the other time. This guy's strong. Did we seriously just do no damage to this guy? What the heck? How good is this guy? His defense is only 12. Well, I guess my strength is pretty darn bad, isn't it? It's only 8. Okay. So, in uh, the light of that nonsense, what are we going to do? I guess what we can do is... <laughs> I don't know. I just don't know. I guess we'll just have to use Oscar or Titania. Even though he's got a Night Killer. Or actually, did he switch out his weapon? Oh, that's what he did. He switched out the weapon to a Javelin. I see. I see how it is. Maybe she'll hit him this time. Finally. Frickin' finally. We'll kill this guy. We will. We got three guys to attack him. And he only got 23 health. Rolf, you're next. Rolf's gonna do some mega damage right here. Nine damage. And then Alanya can finish him off. Boom. So, I mean, it's sad that we lost Boyd already. You know, I just spent a bunch of time getting him up a few levels, but honestly, as far as I'm concerned, if I had to lose somebody, maybe Boyd was the best thing to do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Mia. Delicious, delicious Mia. Look at her in that little skirt. She looks so... She's so fun. Then again, I don't know how old she is. She might be 13, so that's... I'm not allowed to say that. Let's just heal people. Who the heck are we going to heal? Probably the person with the lowest health. Arg, glarg, glarg, glarg. Okay, so... I guess we'll just have to uh, end it up right here. Now what am I going to do? Like I said, I can't believe that this guy's actually... doing so well versus everybody. No damage. Goodness gracious. And that's Ike right there. That's supposed to be my commander. 
the commander. Oh, I'm the com I'm the commander, really. But I'm Ike, I guess. Am I Ike? I don't understand. I'm kind of confused. Okay, let's go, Oscar. And he's got the Night Killer again. But, oh, we might actually kill him right here. Did 14 damage to Oscar, but nope. No way. Can't take us down. Urgh, scarf, scarf, snarf, snurf. Snurf, snarf, And we got a bunch of experience for that. Oh, and we got an arm scroll. I don't know what the heck that is, but I like it. <clears throat> Boom. Getting bank over here, and let's just uh, heal somebody, and that's pretty much the end. Yeah, yeah. Doesn't really matter who we heal. I want to get some experience out of that. Pretty long level, though. I can't lie. This is a 30-minute video, actually. And we, oh, man, we lost Boyd. We lost Boyd. And we got a defense. Yes. Yes, we got a defense. Now, I guess we can heal him again since we got it. Oh, they finally, finally figured it out. How to heal themselves. De-poisoned. She's actually getting hurt a lot, though. That's a lot of damage. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know what's up with me. I just keep burping. I didn't even, like, eat anything or drink anything weird lately. I could just sit here and keep staffing people for a very long time, but I don't think it's worth it. I think you get some experience for uh, completing the level in a certain amount of time, and I think we're actually going to get a bonus experience for doing that. So maybe it's worth it, blah, blah, blah. Seems unlikely that they were merely pursuing Princess Lincia. I wonder if Dan is planning to invade Gallia. Perhaps Crimea was only a stone on which to wet their blades. Oh, no. I think they said... I don't know if wet, W-H-E-T, is a word, but uh, I think they meant W-E-T, and they misspelled it, maybe. I don't know. We are human. Would you truly have a side with with Lagoos? Against other humans? That is unthinkable! Bjork and Lagoos, are you going to sit here and argue about a war that hasn't started? Your Bjork are all so timid, it's pathetic. <laughs> Will it come to war? Our claws are sharp. If Dan invades Galley, we are ready for battle. Oh, yeah. Enough, we have lost much time. Let us make for the palace. <laughs> it's very far. Oh, on your skinny Bjork legs. So anyways, that's going to be the end of this video. As always, please press that little like button. For oh, whoop, whoop, wait, hold on. What's going on here? Got the Castle Gallia. Let's check it out. See what's happening. My lord, I like everyone. Princess Lindsay, I heard about Commander Grill. Oh, I don't know what to say. Hmm. The king has arrived. Um, hey there. Thank you for coming. To oh, this is pretty intense music right here. I am Canagus. Kane Canagus? I, I don't know how to pronounce any of these things. Canagus. Young pup, I didn't recognize you. What? When last you were here, you were still a small child. Is that you, Titania? It's good to see you. The pleasure's all mine, Your Majesty. You two are friends? How did you, the king know me? Hmm, I have something I must tell you about your father. Greel. Let Mordecai leave us now. Prepare rooms so our guests may have a place to rest and heal their wounds. Okay. No, Princess, I would have you stay, and this one also will stay. Ooh, it's Gifka. This is Gifka, my shadow. Pay him no more head than you would the air. Understood. Where to begin? Ike was raised with no knowledge of Gallia whatsoever, nor does he recall ever have been here. What? I, was, I don't remember any of this stuff. To be honest, I probably never watched this stuff. I just kind of skipped through it all. So I'm finally actually going through the story now. Um, We are all exceptional men. We're exceptional men. Men in whom one could put in his trust. <laughs> Females, you are unique. You are most gracious, your majesty. My father was a mercenary of Gallia, correct? And you and your sister were born here in Gallia? Oh, no. Is that so? I don't remember any of this at all. I feel your parents were carrying a dark secret. Someone was hunting them. I'm sure of it. Once, over ten years ago, after your mother has been slain, your father chose to leave Gallia. Before he left, I went to him and asked him to share his tale. I asked him, why are you being chased? Is there anything I can do to help? But I was unable to loosen his tongue. And then I heard he had returned to Gallia. And I thought I had another chance to hear his tale. His fate was black indeed. Oh, no. Wait, now I understand the voice I heard. That was you, wasn't it? His wound was fatal. I could do nothing. I thought it was best not to interfere in his final moments, so I remained hidden. Tell me, Ike, in his last, did he confess anything to you? The identity of the Black Knight, did he reveal it? The Black Knight? No, I don't know who he was. My father trusted me with his command, and he told me to trust King Canaeus and to live peacefully in Gallia. He said to forget everything else. Is that so? Well, then, let me do as best I can. If any of your mercenaries desire to live here, I will so arrange it. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. We could just chill here forever. 
And there's Ike and all this epic music. Oh, yeah. You've been matured like that. It must seem like yesterday that you're merely a child. Titania, and now it ask a boon of you. Strength of a mercenary band, Ike, would you lend it to Princess Lelintia? Are you serious? King Canaeus, Galia, and Crimea are allied nations that cannot be denied. However, this alliance in reality binds only to the royal family that is not respected by our citizenry. Citizenry? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, nobody really understands the Lagoose. I mean, everybody just calls them subhumans and crap like that. That's not cool. It's like calling a white person a cracker. <coughs> I suppose. Maybe. Um, what do you say? Is this what you want? Well, okay. However you wish to proceed is fine. I'll do all my power to ensure that you lead us to success. Thank you very much. I only pray that I and Karen may be worthy of your service. Ooh. Worthy of your service. Oh, man. She really likes that guy. So, anyways, now this is the end of the video. As always, thank you for watching. Have a great day! Blue, 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 boink.